Yamaha XJ6 600. I'm going to dedicate this video to penning. This bike got me to work up and down to London for a few years. Am I going to sell it? No, I'm not. I'm going to keep it. It doesn't cost me anything. It's extremely reliable. And it's a damn good bike. I used to have a big Tom Tom on here. I took it off because I now use Waze on here. As you can see, it's done. How many miles has it done? So I bought it with three, I think 3,000 miles on it. It's now done 39,482. I think when I got it off Penny, I, I, it had 3,000 miles or just under and a full tank of fuel. Never forgot that. So as you can see, it's in fantastic condition. Had a couple of mishaps. Let me tell you about the mishaps. First one. Yes, I got another job. Obviously it's YouTube, so I don't want to go into too much detail, but I parked this at my job, which was about a 200 yard commute. And I put a chain round here. Big heavy chain. So when I was on my way home, I started up the bike in the yard at my new job, forgot to take the chain off and threw myself over the handlebars because I pulled off at a bit of a rate of speed with a chain around the front wheel and off I came. So it didn't do any damage, luckily. I think. This might have been pushed back a bit because the chain come up here so i think it might have pushed this back a bit but i can't be certain i'm not sure whether that should be this might have slightly bent because it, it did throw me off i dropped the bike luckily what saved the day was these on the other side these saved the day the crash bungs so there was no damage it's, it's been mot'd since then and there's no damage to the forks i was worried that i'd bent these forks but I was going so slow that I don't think I did any damage. So I just started it up, drove off, left, left the chain around the wheel and threw myself over the handlebars. So that was the first incident, having driven to London hundreds of times with zero incidents. And the second one was I got home, got off the bike and walked off I forgot to put the side stand down so the bike just went straight over yep it's hard to believe that isn't it I actually rode the bike home from a hundred yards got off the bike and went inside and forgot to put the side stand down so the whole bike just went straight over on the concrete that cost me I think about 90 quid for a new mirror this one over here this mirror was totally obliterated. It exploded as it hit the floor. So this is a brand spanking new mirror. This piece here cost me 90 quid. So I got it and I fitted it and now it's okay. Um, these bikes were used a lot for couriers. I've got a mate of mine who works for Yamaha and he said there aren't many of these left now. Most of them have been written off. They've gone, they're finished. This one's in retirement now, as I am. Um, so I'm just gonna keep it. It's a good bike, it's served me well, and I've got no intentions of getting rid of it. This is its best side. Bikes always have a best side. So this is a Yamaha XJ6 600, four cylinder. It's a four-cylinder engine. It's quite quick. 
Let's start her up. Engine on. Still got the stock exhaust, this small exhaust, because it's good for the neighbours when you wake up at four in the morning. Well, as I used to. So it doesn't wake the neighbours up. It's got the little exhaust. So, yeah, I'm happy with this bike. I think I've got seven, seven classic bikes, two, two bikes modern, three classic cars, two normal cars, two tractors. What's going to be next? Let's wait and see. But I've got big plans. Thanks for watching.